And so when was, uh, you did, I know, I know you did a stint in the army as well. So how, how did, did that, yeah. so you're in a, you're going to Long Beach state yeah. and you're playing in bands. Why the army? Well, I was always a straight A student, but I always kind of really did not like the way academic world is really set up. I found it to be extremely boring. But what happened, I was in my fourth or fifth semester and I got violently sick with, with this really bad fever that lasted like 10 to 14 days. I was almost like unconscious. Tried to come back to college and they had dropped me from a bunch of my classes. Neither one of my parents had been to college. Nobody thought to call the college. So when I tried to petition the classes, they wouldn't let me back in. And at that time, it was the height of Vietnam. Oh, so this it was is, the draft. It was the lottery. It was the draft. And if you weren't in college, you were going to be 1A. I was six weeks later, I was in the Army. That fast. Wow. Yeah, what, scary. What year, so that was like 66, probably? It 65? was 67 66, in 67. about April. Right in the middle of the hottest. Yep. Yeah. They just kept sending more guys in there. So, so you went to Vietnam? I didn't. I really was very fortunate. I was trained as a really radio teletap operator. Everybody was going to Nam. Once in a while, one would go to Korea. They sent me to Germany. Wow. Yeah, and I think God really Probably spared my saved life your on life. that. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. I saw Jimi Hendrix in Germany. Really? I did. <laughs> he blew up three amps tonight. It was awesome. 